Hi. This is started. My. I have, um, I have my LED lights and stands in, in the Oh, cool. Yeah, I don't know. Will it work outside now? Probably at night, right? That sounds. My foot is maybe too hot outside. That's a good idea. I don't have them with me, though. I'd have to stop doing this. Oh, here we go. All right, it's live. We're heat. Let's see. At the pool, my friends are here, but they don't want to come on the live stream. Say hi. <laughs> um, hold on. Uh, just sitting at the pool right now, guys. It's really hot out today. Super hot. Is that Carlos? So Okay. All right. Something. All right. We are now live. I have you guys under a chair that's in the shade, so hopefully it's okay. Good to see you guys. Hey, Lauren. Hey, Mark. How are you? Working? I'm trying to put like shade underneath here. I just step out, uh, not fun and painful. Argentina, what's up Argentina? Maybe I need to move this chair, let's see. Ooh, it's so hot. I think it's like 90 something degrees today. It is intensely hot. Let's see, if I go this way and put you guys here, is this better? Hey, Brian, how are you guys? We are at my pool right now. Um, I've just been floating on this awesome float, <laughs> going around in circles. Ah! And now I'm like, my foot, I'm soaking because I stepped on a bee, which was very uncomfortable. Not very nice to step on bees, guys. I do not recommend it. Uh, so my foot is hurting me like crazy. Good to see you. What's up, Steve Calderon? I got this uh, bikini. It was new. Um, it had tags on it at a yard sale for $3. What do you think? Was it worth it? Let me know. <laughs> Definitely pool weather. Yes, yeah, Steve, you should come over and jump in the pool. Only Steve, Steve Zarita. Not any other Steves. <laughs> and if I meet you, Steve Calderon, in real life. Save the bees. Yeah, I know. I sit. So what happened was there was a bee. I always try to save the bees that go into my pool and I put them on the side and I had just saved one and I forgot about it. And I don't know, it was like still alive, but maybe it was like kind of like not, it was just not breathing. I don't know what happened. I stepped on the bee. So it was kind of like a weird message from God. It's like, yeah, you can save a bee, but you might step up on it and it will sting you. So yeah, this is life. What's up, James? How are you guys? Enjoying my pool right now. My friends were like, is it good enough to swim in? It's great. I was really excited. I met a, a new pool. I've been doing the pool myself, but when I go to New York, I really do not trust Carlos to update it. So there was a guy and his wife uh, putting their cards down and he's a pool cleaner. So maybe I'll hire him. Uh, get a, we're gonna see. We're gonna see, I don't know, but I'm very happy about my pool. He did tell me I need more chlorine though, so I have to do that. Uh, but it's nice. I'm just enjoying this beautiful day. In my backyard. Kinda hungry. How are you all? Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the pool. Thank you for following me. I am just enjoying this sunny day. I'm getting ready for Prime Day, really excited about it. I'm gonna do a whole like live stream thing. Super, super awesome for Prime Day. Um, yeah, just uh, But now we're finally getting better weather. 
And I've just been brushing my pool a lot. <laughs> I still have leftover lasagna, so I'm excited to eat it. What are you guys doing? Hi, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to this pool day. I am Lauren at the pool right now, wanting to just hang out with you all. I was like, let's hang out with everybody, go in the pool, chill. It's like I'm getting tan, I'm exercising, I'm live streaming, so I'm happy about that. Uh, this bathing suit is Victoria's Secret, not sure if I love it or not. Let me know, should I keep it or let it go? I have been uh, going through my closet here for days, trying to figure out what I should keep and what I should get rid of. I have too much stuff, guys too much stuff <laughs> so yeah that is what I'm doing oh my god my foot hurts so bad it hurts so so bad so we're doing that right now dealing with life I stepped on a bee for those of you who tuned in I don't know if there's like any remedies for it but it hurt it, like I think the last time I got stung by a bee when it was when I was like eight years old so I guess this is life, I don't know, but yeah, yeah. All right. Last night I had Popeyes for dinner, it was really good. I hate though, like, you'll get a meal and they'll put like three wings in it. They like try to trick you and give you more wings, you know? very frustrating Popeyes and their wings scam I don't know if you guys uh, ever oh no my other phone uh, said it's too hot and shut off I guess it is too it is really hot put ice on it the phone or my foot probably the, the foot the foot oh yeah I got like 600 people here probably have like white um, white, uh, what's it called on my face? Um, sunscreen. Here, I'm just gonna bring you in the pool with me. Hopefully the, the phone doesn't, uh, fall in. All right, we're all gonna go swimming together, guys. Um, we're going swimming. We are, wait, you know what I could do, actually, uh, in the cup, like, but the water cup thing is filled with water. Your foot. Um, let them fall at this point. It's okay, it'll be all right. No, I know, I know. Hopefully this phone, I, I need like, like an umbrella for my phone for the live streaming. Maybe they have something like that. Like that'd be a good invention. Like something to protect the phone from overheating when you're live streaming. <laughs> Let's make it guys. Make it, I'll sell it. <laughs> Give me a percentage. Uh, it's so pretty out. What are you doing today? Mahaki Tao, what's up Philippines? How are you? Oh wow, Lauren, way to live, way to trailer. Lively, Lauren. What's up, RJ? How are you? Enjoy and be safe. Hot, thank you. I am fascinated with carpenter bees. I am from New York, nice. I love your tan, thank you. A phone life jacket, yes. Oh, what's up? Shout out to Northeast Ohio. How are you guys? Yep, my name is Lauren. I have uh, been a social media person for a very long time. Very, very long time. And uh, yeah, this is fun. We're just swimming right now. I am swimming with 700 people right now. Guys, you are metaphorically all swimming with me. <laughs> It's just too pretty out. What's up, Denver? How are you? You gotta check on the dogs. My friends are inside with the dogs, so they're okay. Getting ready to fly to Honolulu, Hawaii for 4th of July. Oh my goodness, I'm so jealous. I've always, I've never been to Hawaii. I've always wanted to go. That would be awesome. All right. I love you too, guys. I love you too. Oh, it's so pretty out. It is so pretty. So pretty, pretty. 
I would love to go out on the Colorado River. The bear drank too much. Cannonball. Check out the teddy bear sun tanning. Ha ha ha, yes. That's Abdullah over there. Shout out to Abdullah. He lives in the backyard. <laughs> nice guys. Love your bikini. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. We are just chilling. I am uh, soaking my foot. Soaking it. Come to Wisconsin. Yes, I would love to come to Wisconsin. I do have to go to my P.O. box soon. I do have a package inside from Mike the Mechanic that I saw. Um, I will open that probably later tonight. Not in the pool, of course. Um, very excited to unbox it. So, yeah. Good to see you guys. Oh, boy. Love your bikini. Thank you. It's really pretty out. I'm just exercising and swimming. What did you say when you stepped on the beach? I, I was just like, oh no. No, why did I do that? Oh, life. I always love talking to you. Thank you guys. <laughs> I like, you know, I heard about people stepping on bees before, but I'm like, I always thought like, oh, that's really stupid. How would someone do that? And then of course I do it. Life. So yeah. Say hi to Kyle. Hi, Kyle. Okay. Mmm, this feels so nice. I like the color of your bikini. Thank you. So should we keep it or donate this bikini? <laughs> I'm like wearing things once and getting rid of them. That's my new thing. You are dropping. <laughs> yes. Good morning. Doesn't it always work that way? Uh, for sure. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Oh my goodness. Brian said keep. Keep your swimsuit. Thank you. Keep it for sure. Do you think it was worth $3? <laughs> you know, it had tags on it. And it was Victoria's Secret. That's why I kept it. But yeah. I do like, I feel like there's something, like if I do like a picture in each outfit and then sell the outfit, I think then it's like worth it. Cause like once I shoot in it once, it's like, why should I, I can't wear it again. You guys are gonna judge me. So, <laughs> we'll see. Where are you from? I am from New York. I live in LA. Thank you guys for following me. I appreciate it. I appreciate the follows. I do. Steve Calderon said $3 is a good price. Yeah. It's like a, the price of a piece of pizza. It's like, all right, I'm not going to buy that lunch today, but I will get a bikini instead. <laughs> I'll just eat leftovers. Oh my goodness, you had two skunks in your backyard. I hope they didn't spray. <laughs> I always get scared when I'm in New Jersey because there's so many skunks and I'm scared that like, they're gonna spray George like he'll be outside because I let him out sometimes to pee but there's so many crazy stories about people I always have to like be right there because I've always heard these crazy stories about people who let their dog out and then there's like a giant bear it's awful I remember there was like I think it was last year this like older lady let her dog out and there was a bear and then she got killed trying to save the dog so Oh, Brian said I could have gotten it for two ninety nine. Yeah. Good bikini, thank you. Yeah, something Italian. Yes. Oh my goodness, my foot hurts so bad, guys. I'm just like soaking it in the water. Thank you so much. If anyone has stars, please send me stars. Please send me the stars. Um, that's all I think about is bears when you mention that state. George could have taken the bear. I don't know about that. So, we're here. 
Love you too, guys. Love you too. Oh, I'm just enjoying my backyard. It's beautiful. Marvelous. Love you, friends. Keep in touch. Put Arnica on your foot. Oh, that's a good idea. I don't know if I have any here, though. I have to look. I have been your friend since 2015. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, thank you, Ron Johnson, for the stars. Thank you. See, ask and you shall receive. Amazing. Swimming pool. Yep. Love it. Help me, please. Yes. All right. Thank you, guys. Oh, thank you, James Foley. Thank you so much. All right. Where's your hat, Lauren? Oh, that's a, that would be a good idea. I should get a hat on. Oh, thank you so much for the 100 stars. Thank you, Jonathan Ditto. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. I appreciate y'all. Love it. Looks like beautiful weather there. I'm from Ontario, Canada. Cool and foggy here. Gotcha. No, I, it's been kind of gloomy all summer, so I'm happy that it's finally, we had a hot week. So I'm happy about that. Happy about that. I do need to sweep the sides. I can, I should ask Carlos to do it. Here we are. Francesca, where are you from? I am from New York. I live in LA. So, so yeah, it feels so pretty out. All hugs. Thank you. Uh, I, I am the friend that sent you the gold coin. Thank you. I love that gold coin. What's up, Algeria? How are you? Good to see you. Good, good, good to see you. I appreciate you all. I need your pool. Yes. Oh, hey, Mike, you should come over. Come swimming. Bring Tanya. <laughs> yeah. I, uh... I finally have gotten kind of uh, clean with the chlorine. It's It's been a lot to like learn how to, to do it. So <laughs> it's been a lot. It's been smoky here. I know my parents are in New Jersey. I forget what state you're in, Brian. Um, and they said it's really smoky. They had like air warnings and stuff. So I feel really bad, but it also makes me think I should stay in LA a little bit longer because I'm like, you know, I don't want to go there for the smoke warnings and whatnot. So, yeah. Chicago. Oh, wow. It's bad in Chicago, too. Okay. Beautiful girl in the swimming pool. Thank you. Thank you, guys. I need to get my sunglasses. It'll be, like, a lot easier to, like, not squint in your face. Oh boy. It's really, it feels nice though. I'm just enjoying this. Enjoying the weather. Swimming, swimming in the pool. It's getting better, but it was awful. Yeah, I know my parents said it was bad today, so. So yeah, my mom was gonna go on the lake and then she said, oh, it's so smoky out, I probably should stay inside. Oh, I can't, I can't. What's going on with our country? I wish, you know what, I wish I had sunglasses outside. Like the fact that I leave them inside is very frustrating. Hopefully your foot gets better. I know, I hope so too. I'm like scared to even walk on my concrete. <laughs> I'm like, what kind of animals am I gonna see? Let's see. Ooh. I was hoping, like, I was, I put the phone, I thought, in the shade, and it's still, it's still overheated. So I gotta put it in the shade now. Like, really, underneath the table. 
Okay. Gonna get some sunglasses. Oh wait, are these sunglasses on my table? Perfect. Let's see where the dogs are. Okay. Dogs are okay. Oh, my face is red. Even though I put sunscreen on, guys, my face is red. Here we go. Oh, but then it's like hard to read the comments. But it's so pretty. Should we jump on the unicorn? Or the shark? It's like, yes, I'm having this pool party alone right now. I should tell my friends online on Facebook. I should be like, need friends to hang out with at my pool. Let me know if you want to come over. I feel like when I lived and I didn't have a pool, I would just, I would go to my friend Sean's house every day, my friend Sean Pressler, who actually was nice enough to let me show up. I haven't seen him in like two years since like before the pandemic. And he was like nice enough to let me shoot. I shot him the beginning, some insert scenes for pay to die at his house. So thank God uh, he let me do that because he has a huge house. Oh, someone said shark. <laughs> I, I just saw that now. Oh. I feel like I should sit on the step. It's very hard. I'm like falling off of this big one. It's like pushing me off this unicorn. This unicorn. I'm looking for, I need to get storage sheds for outside, guys. If you, have, if you know any good ones that are, like, cheap. The, the nicest one I found is this pink one, of course. But it's 300 bucks, so I'm trying to decide if I should get that. Or if I should just get, like, the metal ones, because I'm going to need a few. I'm emptying my garage out, because I have so much stuff in it from the movie things. So I have to get rid of it. So, yeah. Mm. That's what she said. Mm. Thank you guys for joining us. Where's the other float? That was a better one. Cause it's like lower to the pool. Hi guys. Hanging out here at the pool, trying to face away from the sun. It's really nice though. I'm really liking the pool. Super fun. Guys, do me a favor and share this stream. I'm trying to grow my page back. I, uh, for some reason, I haven't had any growth, so let me know if you could uh, share this. What's up, everybody? I need, like, water or something. I'm getting thirsty. I, like, got up to get the sunglasses. I should have got, like, some water. It's, like, oh, it's really important when you're in the sun to hydrate. Oh, my goodness, guys. Remember my favorite necklace? I was feeling so lost and sad, and I've lost this necklace for about six months to a year. I couldn't find it anywhere, and I magically found it yesterday or two days ago. I forget what it was. I gotta make sure I don't leave it the phone in one place because I think it overheats. Oh God. Oh, can you, what's up? Happy birthday, Carl. Kyle from Wisconsin. Oh no, did I just get my phone in the water? I just like put the phone into the water. Mm. All right. Bon dia. Good to see you. Yeah, I could, I have some lunch right now. That would be nice. We should have some lunch. Mm. Just in the pool. Hey, Archie. Hey, Lauren, how have you been? I'm great just swimming in the pool right now. <laughs> share this for you. Thank you, guys. If you could share it to groups, too, that really helps. Um, I don't know what that was that couch group people were sharing it to. Yes, please share it. Sharing is caring. I might do a live later tonight. I have so much cleaning to do. My room is a disaster. I've just been cleaning my room. And then I have my garage to tackle. So that's like another thing. You speak French. No, I do not speak French. I wish I did. I wish I spoke some French. Hello. Good to see you guys in the pool. Stop reconnecting. Mm, it feels so good to be in the water, guys. I'm just relaxing. Hi, Po. Mahakita. Mm. 
Lauren, you speak French? No, I only speak English. I know some words and phrases from different countries from my viewers, like uh, fala to the bang, that's uh, Portuguese. Hola, como estas is Spanish. Um, como parlez-vous francais, that's French. <laughs> How hot is it there? I think it's in the 90s right now. It feels it. It feels it. Thank you guys for the stars. Thank you for the shares. Thank you for the follows. I appreciate you all as I'm swimming and trying to work out my legs right now. I've been so sore from wrestling, so this feels really good. Guys, I started taking wrestling classes. And like, honestly, it's a lot of uh, arm work. <laughs> like I need to like pick people up and stuff. I'm very funny though. I like, there are certain things I'm just like, I'm not doing that. <laughs> So I don't know, I guess I'm not the teacher's favorite, but whatever. It's fun though. Oh, you know, tamal, 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 tamal. I, you know, I need to have somebody teach me it, I guess. That would be the best. Y'all could teach it to me. Say, oh, I don't know. What does that mean in German? Let me know what it means in German before I say things. You can throw me around. <laughs> it's 103 degrees Fahrenheit where I'm at. Good pool weather. Wow, Steve. I wonder if it's that hot here. Oh my goodness. Where do you, I forget. Yeah, don't tell everybody where you live, Steve, but wow. That's hot. Yeah. I know you have a pool, Steve. I actually, you know, maybe you can help me research this. I want to get like a cover for my pool. Just because, and I don't know, I know um, Royal Navy, who helps me with my Twitch, has one of those automatic ones. I just get so much leaves in the pool, and I feel like we can make it stay warmer. Although the temperature right now is, like, perfect. So I'm happy. I did want to get a solar heater. Um, Steve, you probably have a solar heater. Do, do you have a solar heater? Let me know. We should do a, a Facebook uh <laughs> A Facebook talk where you guys tell me what to, uh, <laughs> all the things I need to get for my house. <laughs> That's what I need to do. What's your latest movie, Lauren? I have two that I'm working on uh, developing right now. Three potentially. Uh, you know, it's just a lot of work and then I'm editing a bunch. So it's a lot of work. Lots and lots of work. I used to be a great wrestler here in Wisconsin. Oh, I didn't know that, Kyle. You were a wrestler? Get out. That's so cool. Troy said solar heater. Yes. Just use tin foil. Do you, how much does a solar heater heat a pool? Like, will it heat it like only five degrees or can we get it like, you know, 20 degrees more? You can follow along and check out our IMDb. Thank you, Jeremy. Oh, guten Abend. It's good evening. Did I say it right? Gutnieb? Gutnieb? I don't know. Let me put my sunglasses back on. You know, they say that you get wrinkles um, from squinting your eyes in the sun. That's like one of the, the most things that cause wrinkles. So I always try to put sunglasses on, but then it's so dark I can't see what you guys are saying. So I probably should put this on. Solar heater for the pool. Do you know India? Yes, I actually have um, an Indian YouTube channel that I react to Indian trailers. It's called Secret Life of Lauren, if you want to check that out. Um, what's up, Juan Fernandez? Hi, how are you? I have an electric heater, but it's not connected to electricity yet. Gotcha. See, Steve Brown, with all your Tesla knowledge, I would have thought you got a solar one. Any reason why not? Why not solar? Um, let's see, somebody else said something. Do you live on TikTok? Occasionally, I just don't have that many devices. Um, you know, I really haven't uh, focused much time on that platform but maybe i should i like to do like the funny videos like i'll find funny voices to lip sync to it's just like some kind of you know funniness that i like to work on but yeah is that a cat i heard like a, a noise you wrestled oh my goodness kyle you must be really good you wrestled for almost 20 20 years wow you got to send me some of your wrestling videos that's so cool 
Yeah, I mean, I'm not very good. I was, uh, so I'm, I'm in a professional wrestling school and everyone's really good. Right now they're teaching us how to jump over the top rope. And I don't know, I mean, I, I, I can't quite do it yet. So we'll see. <laughs> I have bruises on my arms. Everyone was like, what happened? Are you getting in fights with people? I'm like, no, I'm wrestling. So yeah, a copper, a copper ionizer will help kill the algae. You know what I got? I got, um, this stuff called phosphory or something and I put that in there for the first time and I think like it looks a lot better oh your electricity is powered by 11 to 12 solar system with 36 panels on your roof gotcha Kyle I don't want to say here because I don't I just don't want any strangers showing up to do wrestling with me um just because uh you know it's uh people can be creepy <laughs> like all of a sudden like <laughs> random people will be like I want to wrestle with Lauren <laughs> oh <laughs> I'm sure you'll be great thank you so um Steve how much was it to get the solar panels on your roof and do they work my electric bill is insane it's just it's unbelievable how expensive the electricity and the water is here in California um especially because you know I have a lot of people in my house, so yeah, wrestling is hard. You can easily fall on the top rope. Yes, yes. I mean, I'm just learning like basic stuff like bumps and uh, like whole different kinds of holds and stuff, which I think is good for acting. It's good for me to like know those moves in case I have an audition. So this way I can train and it's also like a great workout. like. But I mean, I, some of the more intense wrestlers, I've been watching The Dark Side of the Ring recently. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that TV show. And it is crazy. I mean, it's just like really sad stories. And honestly, like looking at like Logan Paul, it's just crazy. Gotcha. Oh, Steve said his, his solar panels were 40000 but I bought it and paid for it with the purchase of the house. Wow. <laughs> That's awesome, Steve. That's a lot of money, though. But I guess it's good because you don't have to pay an electric bill, right? So that's good. <laughs> I am in the pool. No way to control it. Big WWE fan here. Yeah, I love WWE. It's awesome to watch. You know, we'll see. Maybe I could be like, my friend was like, oh, you could be like my valet. Um, oh, somebody said the wrestling, the dark side of the ring with Dork the Clown is sad. Yeah, I think like, the, which one did I watch? The one about the Von Erickson brothers. That one got, I was just crying. Like that one really made me sad. It was just crazy how much tragedy their whole family had. Like, every single one of the brothers, like, except one. It was just really, really depressing. And, yeah, watching Money in the Bank tomorrow. <laughs> Keep in touch. Yes. Hey, what's up, guys? We are swimming in the pool. Yes, Michael. It's a good, it's a good show. Any other shows you guys think I should watch? I, I'm like all I like after Succession. I'm like I don't know what to watch. Ooh, it's a crazy business that business. All right, I'm doing a photography job with RVD. What's that? The electricity bill is usually a credit every month, especially in the summer days. Oh, that's amazing! So you get money each month, Steve. Is that true? Wait, wait. So each month you're making money from your electricity bill? Like, so one of my friends told me this thing about how, like, you could purchase properties and get, like, solar panels. How is that? What is going on? Oh, boy. Hold on, guys. Where's Benny? Where's Sammy? Oh, boy. All right. Okay, just, just checking the front of my house. Do you ever fertilize your citrus trees? I actually gave the fertilizer to my gardener. I hope he did. 
there's still like a full bag left so i don't know if he actually did my problem is is that i have to rake the tree so maybe we should do it right now could be a thing we do together let's fertilize the citrus tree right now you can solar farm so how can you make money that is usually like so you can make money if you put if you put a thing on your if you put the solar panels on I'm like I'm all I'm all into like seeing how I can like monetize my life <laughs> everything is so expensive especially groceries look at my face right now it's so red oh no I put th 30 on my face They total it up on a yearly basis and you get paid for wholesale value in unused energy. So then Steve Brown, how much a year like, ca could you make on it? So wait, how do you put the fertilizer on? Do I just rake this area and then put the fertilizer on? Let me know. I have the citrus food. I was watching this Martha Stewart thing <laughs> as I'm cleaning my room. I've just been watching weird TV and it was like talking about like, how to uh, feed your plants and how like feeding your plants is like the most important thing. Where is this tree? Oh boy, lemon tree, where are you? It's so weird, this lemon tree. Okay, what is this like? Break it, I think he did maybe put it. So then I have to put dirt on top of it or what? What do you do after you do it? So I raked it, let's see. Side dress fertilize around the base. Side dress fertilize. Let's see. I don't know if this is fertilizer or what is this. This is citrus and uh, here. Look at this citrus and avocado plant food. So I think this is different. <laughs> I think that's just food, water, and and deep and frequent. Oh boy. All right. I'm just gonna put the plant food down. Oversized system based on, all right, well, I'm not very good at this. I've already dropped a bunch of the plant food. Did I get it by the tree? All right, well, hopefully, yeah. It's really pretty out. <laughs> you need FPF nuclear reactions, yeah. Okay, back into the pool. Oh, it's so nice out. Okay. Very pretty out. Okay. Okay. Well, guys, I'm going to go make some food right now. I love you all. This was fun. It's a beautiful day out. Spend some time outside. If you're not in the smoke, dealing with smoke right now from the fires but uh if it's beautiful out by you enjoy somebody said put lo brian said put lotion on your back i need someone cannot wait till the fall why i love summer i love summer i have no one to put the lotion i actually got this like thing from the dollar tree that you like you go like this it's like at a, it's like a back scratcher but with a lotion thing it's really cool i use the alaska is one which what is Alaska is one 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 five is that like a kind of uh yeah I haven't had I don't know when my oranges are supposed to grow like honestly I my oranges my lemons like I haven't had lemons yet and it's kind of sad I remember last year at this time I had lemons no lemons no lemons so kind of frustrating I don't know if my lemons are confused why are you grow not growing lemons Grow me some lemons. It's very sad. Or maybe it's just too hot. Or maybe there's just too much water. I don't know why there's no lemons. All right. Anyway, good to hang out. Thank you for watching, guys. I'm going to go get some lunch. Um, I love you so much. I love you, love you, love you. All right. I'll see you later, guys. Bye.